Alright, welcome back to Let's Play Final Fantasy X, viewers. So, uh, let's uh, finish this boss fight here. And, uh... Let's get, uh... Just here. As you can see, he has, a uh, Protecting Shell still on. So let's, uh, first of all, do a power break on him. That's gonna reduce his, uh attack power considerably. Let's see if you Since everyone had a turn, I'm not really afraid anymore of uh, switching party members. I'm gonna stick with these three. And I'm gonna be basically curing. I'm gonna be yeah. Under 9,900. Yeah, like that. So, uh, one more. And let's do a grand summon difference. Wendigo is weak to fire. Let's uh, fire his ass. Killed the Wendigo, you needed a thousand four hundred and thirty two damage. Instead of two thousand, we get three thousand AP. It's still not dead. What the hell? Gosh. And we got a ton of AP. Your abilities here, Seeker's Ring. <sighs> so, let's see what happens. Uh, Praise be to Yevon. That's what I would have said if I was a follower of Yevon. We were all there, and in one piece. Even if I had a headache from wondering what was in store for us next. Alright, so, first of all, let's do a quick save. We're under the lake ice, aren't we? Look. That's the bottom of the temple. Huh. So we're under a lake. <sighs> We've fallen a long way. So wait. We're underwater? What now, I wonder? What now? Uh, you act first and think later, don't you? I mean, can't you be a little more responsible? We're all depending on you, <laughs> you know? A lecture. No, no, no. <laughs> Just a suggestion. You should place trust in your friends. But you can't expect someone to protect you all the time. You would do well to remember that. Is that a lecture? It's advice. <laughs> uh, that's a good one. Now, there are two treasure chests in here. Waka. <sighs> hey, Waka, would you cheer up? Uh, look, we only did what we had to do. It doesn't matter. Don't you see? 
I've always walked the path of Yevon. But now, I'm a traitor! How could this happen? Damn! It's not Riku's fault either. Huh? <sighs> you don't know how I feel. Yeah, well, blame Seymour. Uh, Yuna's there, but let's not talk to her right now. Yuna will wake soon. Kimari knows this. Yeah, and right behind Kimari, there's a treasure chest that we... Mm. God damn it. Yeah, we can't get to it. Yet. Same thing with... I'm sure Yuni's okay. She's breathing fine and all. How are Lulu and Waka? Hmm. Well, Waka's in shock. Can't blame him either. And Lulu? Well, she's just the same as always. She's so together. All grown up, I guess. I guess. Well, just give me five or six <laughs> more years. So, Kamari, how do we get out of here? Hey, don't change the subject. We climb. Kimari too. Only those who try will become. Huh? I think he means you have to work hard if you want to be like Lulu. Oh, I will. Kimari think Riku should stay Riku. Huh? Hey, are you saying I'll never be like Lulu? Kimari! <laughs> How can you laugh at a time like this? <sighs> Yuna? <sighs> and Yuna wakes up. Finally. I wanted to confront Maester Seymour about his father, Lord Jisko. I wanted to convince him to turn himself in to Yevon's judgment. In exchange for marriage? Yes, if that's what it took. So, what did Seymour say? He didn't say anything. Now, I... now I don't even think it was worth it. I should have told you what I was going to do. Enough! Dwelling in the past is futile. Hey! You don't have to say it like that! You want to waste time listening to her regrets? You don't have to say it like that. Our immediate concern is Yuna's pilgrimage. Are you willing to go on? Yes. But then, do you think Yevon will allow it? The Faith are the ones that give power to the Summoners. Not the Temples or the Teachings. If the Temples try to stop us, then we will defy Yevon if we must. Whoa! I can't believe you said that! Sir Oren? Count me out. We have to atone to make up for the sins we have committed. Of course. It's not like I ever liked Maester Seymour, ya? Yeah? No way I'll ever forgive him for killing Lord Jisco. And for trying to do us all in two, you know? But still... The bunch of us going against Yevon? No way! But still, we have transgressed. And must face our punishment. We must go to Bevel. We must speak with Maester Micah and explain what has happened. There is no other way, I think. I agree. Uh, Sir Oren? So it is decided. Will you come with us? I am the troublemaker, after all. Yeah, that's right! You can always count on Oren to complicate things. Yeah! Kamari roars and Oren runs off, and... I never asked you to follow me. Hey, but that's what friends are for. Right? Yep. 
Thank you. Huh? Friends, huh? <laughs> Man, how can you all act like nothing's wrong? Must got nerves of steel or something. You're too edgy. Listen to the hymn and calm down. Yeah. Anyways. Is that coming from the temple? Yes, it is Yevon's gift. It soothes the hearts of the faithful. Okay, so... Now we can move. And uh, now we can get the treasure chest that's right over here. It contains level 2 key spheres. And over here, if I find it, 